Hey, Sam from 3D here. Today we'll talk about why Blender is not industry standard. Long story short, it is. The thing is, the definition of industry standard changes depending on what exactly you want to know. If you want to know if Blender is compatible with models and textures used in the gaming industry, for example, yes, it is, you can use all of these assets inside Blender. No problem, FBX, OBG, D, PBR textures, all of those are industry standard, meaning gaming industries uses these formats and Blender can fit in that pipeline. You can make professional work with it. Ian Hubert did a whole movie as a VFX supervisor using Blender. Next Gen is another movie made with the help of Blender. There are many artists and studios who use Blender in their workflow for a variety of works, VFX, commercials, modeling, 3D printing, even full movies like I Lost My Body, an Oscar nominee made entirely with the grease pencil. What I think most people are actually asking is, why is Blender not used in big studios? The answer as always depends. There are big studios using Blender like Upsoft Animation Studios. It depends a lot on how these companies do things. For example, Bethesda has been making games since 1986, back then Blender didn't even exist. If you wanted to get into 3D at all, you'd need to use Maya or 3DS Max, so schools and colleges were taught with those softwares in mind. Some of these companies also have tech developed in-house to use with those tools and would be too time-consuming or expensive to change now. Because of that, most people who were into 3D ended up using those softwares and bigger companies tends to be older companies. With the internet popping up and Blender becoming more powerful, this is changing over time. Newer studios are much more inclined to use Blender because it's free and there is plenty of resources online for new people to learn and it is super powerful. Smaller studios and single artists use Blender extensively because Blender is a Swiss army knife in the 3D industry. It can get a lot done in various different fields in a single program. It is not perfect at anything it does, but most of the time it's more than good enough. And again, it's free. For example, a lot of animators are used to Maya and have access to tools that Blender does not have yet, at least not natively. DreamWorks will use whatever software most animators are used to, in this case, Maya. It's great not needing to jump between softwares, especially if you're alone or can't pay multiple licenses for different softwares, you can get all done with great results in Blender. The more time goes on and new talent comes into these companies with Blender in their pocket, the more it will be used across all industries. So in conclusion, yes, Blender can be and it is being used by professionals in many different industries. We hope this video was informative for you. If you want to be around like-minded people, go to our Discord in the description down below. Any suggestions for a next video, leave them in the comments and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.